Hope everyone's had themselves a great holiday so far. But we're gonna go ahead and do this uh, run. And uh, let's go ahead and do this. It is a Link to the Past Randomizer Festive Edition Open Bode. It begins right now. So if you haven't seen this mode just yet, this is a get the eight reindeer so you can get into Ganon's tower. As opposed to the standard rule where you need only seven crystals to get in. Nice. Extra bomb I was not even anticipating. So each of these uh, items, if they're visible in the world, you won't be able to see what they are until you actually touch them, which makes the race game a little more uh, a need to do. You actually have to go through there and tackle it, and I don't know why I even went through the library, because that works the same thing where you're just going to see a gift up there. I have three bombs so I can fully clear this uh, village with the standard stuff, but I'm going to go in a right to left just because of bomb priority at this stage. And that's the other reason why, is because if I get bombs, more the merrier. I also would love to see a can uh, a bottle show up so I can go ahead and take care of the sick kid who will still give me a nice uh, wrapped gift. And plus this also gives me the better chance of having the rupees for uh, the bottle virgin. Well, that's interesting right there. That's, uh, ether. Which could be required. And yet, that could be as well. Another bomb pickup. And now we're tapped out on bombs. Now, any water this gave gets turned into ice. That has a very major implication, and well, that's medallion number two, so. As a result, we end up getting a scenario where we might end up having a uh, Easy check to Zora coming up in due time. Anyway, so no bottles, so I'm gonna have to come back and check that at a later time. Epablyticus, what's up? Okay. 
Stop poking me with your sticks. Nice. Any plans? <laughs> we found the single arrow already. A unique item is in the uh, Lost Woods. That sounds like a nice uh, set of plans. Hope you enjoy yourself. Sword! At this point in time, I actually would like to find some magic. I'm gonna actually pick this up in case he does. No, he's dropping fives. I'm gonna kill a couple of enemies just in case they drop some magic. Well, <laughs> like clockwork right there, friends, like clockwork. Is there a reason why I went to go grab that? Hey, Ninjimbro, happy holidays to you. Hey, there's the green bobble, which means we have access to, uh, since we have now have access to the item as a hospital, that actually works for routing. Still going to need it. Well, let's head on over to Sahasra. Let's see what he has. And all three of these are reindeer. And by reindeer, that means they are required to beat the game. Trying to choose a delicate path in order to not have to deal with uh, the slowdown. Okay, well, that half magic was decent. Let's go over here. 
I want to stay in the light path there, because that's uh, non-snow. Easier to walk through. Some nice items so far, but nothing that would actually open this game up. That won't that won't either that won't open it up either, but I'm gonna go all the way over to Zelda's chest. Oh god. All three medallions within ten minutes. Hey Lost Cards fan. Merry Christmas to you as well. Thank you for good luck wishes. How's your holiday? Well, you stay tuned if you haven't seen this yet. There are several modifications that you'll notice uh, later on. As we oh god! Also, formal congratulations on winning uh, Crim's uh, Fantasy League. You have a good crew of players there, and definitely uh, worked the the wires and all that good stuff. Definitely was. Uh, con well done. That's not the only change that's going to be noticeable. I actually didn't think I was going to get that in time. I have not found any progression yet though, and that's the thing that pro that troubles me at this point. I found Bombos, great. I found Ether, great. I found Quake, great, fantastic, phenomenal. None of them opened anything new to me. That still doesn't open anything, though. That is really the nature of uh, fantasy football, though, is how you deal with injuries. How you deal with players going down for whatever reason. So if I mentioned on Discord, it's, it's it, 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 there's a luck factor that comes into it, definitely. I mean, it sucks that my main quarterback option in uh, Garoppolo ended up going out with a season-ending injury. But that's the nature of it. But how you adjust to it is what makes or breaks your uh, season. I really need some rupees game. But I really could use some progression, and this is what worries me, is the fact that I do not have enough rupees for Zora at this point, and... Still lacking major progression. Where is this progression, though? Like, this is unbelievable. I am still a massive amount of items away from being able to do anything in this seed. Doesn't make sense for me to even check that. I'm walking down to grab it anyway. Don't have enough rupees for you, and I don't have a great setup to grind for rupees.
there's a Gina, there's the items inside Eastern, and that is it. There is nothing else at this point, and that's what worries me. I am getting into a really bad run of luck where it comes down to last items, and... It's the nature of the game, but it really does get a little tiring after a while when it starts becoming always last item for progression. Let's, let, me, let me say this in the Z1R equivalent. This would be no different than knowing that you need the recorder and finding the recorder in the last possible dungeon where you know it has to be there at that point. It's not going to end well. Now, there is progression there. That flute definitely opens the door later on for more stuff to happen. I probably should open that up now. So, what this is open up the flute. It opens up one item at this point. Uh, it opens up the one item that is inside uh, Death Mountain. Yeah, they made some interesting choices, and for the most part, I like their choices. I would be surprised if uh, nobody gets the. I'd be surprised if nobody gets that reference at this point. All things considering. And Merry Christmas to you as well, Bams. How you doing? Are you feeling any better? That I was far enough over to the left that I was going to avoid them. Nice, that's good. Shoot. That's good to hear. Old man, let's have a talk. That's, uh,. On the short list of things that are funny. I had all three medallions at ten minutes in. Two of them were in Kakariko Village, the other one was... Oh... What was it? Hobo, perhaps? Okay, so that means uh, the next stage of... Progression is at one of two places. It's either at Zora... Or it's here in Eastern. Here 
I don't know, Lost Cards fan. If Kiki can use it in a sentence, then we have to let it go through. Armos Knights there is the snow mo snow not Armos Knights the those little Armoses are as snowmen. There's the answer. So now that opens the door to greater exploration. Well, this is a reindeer, so this would be what would be considered a crystal. And yep. To Epibliticus. I got a new, uh, new coat, which I needed. Don't tell uh, Laz all the secrets. I'm waiting for him to find out the big one there, Kiki. They are. So, bombs and purple don't need that. And bombs are the, uh... <laughs> bombs are the, uh, stun prize pack. Oh, long shots are... Long shots. Long... Sh yeah. Long shots are nice for this time of year. Okay, that's two enemies that have hit me with my, my sword stuck out. Okay, so last item will be at the Armos uh, Knights. But more importantly, the next stage of progression's gotta be up here at this point, because why would you give me the flute and this? Yep, no Dark World access, plus no Moon Pearl, so... I love like that everything on my menu currently is on the right side. I'd love to find one of those 300 rupees so I can actually check Zora because that's now a loose square. Now open. 
Okay, that opens up that, uh... Shovel that I just picked up, so that's not in logic. Do I want to know why she did that? Now, more importantly, that does open up the potential of me getting to the back three of escape, where the last several seeds that I've ended up playing have had some sort of progression there. So for those of you who uh, missed the ending of the last seed... Hookshot turned out to be... Over at the... You were saying, Bams? Hookshot was on the uh, Lake Hylia Island. Anyone reading the good books lately? Swing and a miss, strike one. See, definitely is now getting to be more interesting. Oh, I don't have that. I don't have gloves to steal a key. Uh, that's also not how you do that, by the way. Thank you. 
There's little green things, Laz, by the way, if you're noticing. Those are ice. You start doing the skating me uh, mechanics for that. It's Gamer Kill! Oh, don't mind if I do move right along. Oh, don't worry, Laz. There will be something coming soon. Unfortunately, for Skull Woods as well, or not Skull Woods, but yeah, Skull Woods area. And for Dark Death Mountain, nope. To me, that was a disappointment, too, though. Unique items above the pose, which would uh, make that more of a requirement. There's Dark World Act. No, that's not Dark World Access. I'm still a hammer away. Emmanuel. I know how to menu this game. Nobody tell me my skills aren't lacking when it comes to that kind of menuing. I know how to go up and down stairs. My, 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 my... My stairs are just so horrible. Oh, true. Have to burn off that, uh, Christmas dinner. No Kiki. Unique item sold by somebody friendly. On that, by the way, that's side number two. We're done in here. I saw your tweet about it. Seemed like you were having fun. Alright, time to face off against the Moldorm. Hi, Moldorm. Don't push me down that hole. Fight. 
Please don't die to Moldorm, okay? I said do not die to Moldorm! Screw this. I am not using that blue potion. I repeat, I am not using that blue potion. Okay, well, all things considering, I am down to two options. Either find something in the back of escape, head to... well, three options, rather. Head to the back three of escape, see if I can't get a key in that one chest in the sewers. Head to Aghanim. Or, see if I can't locate something nice here. At Zora. Because Zora doesn't have anything. It's not like he had anything in the uh, race that I did this morning. Stupid mirror. All right, rip me off for 500 rupees. Zora, what do you have? Yay! Worth every single penny. Actually, no. Okay, can I please go to the right screen that I want to go to instead of this uh, menuing? And yes, the rats have Santa caps on. Of course you're the key. Swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. This is an Aghanim Record Seed. Thank you. 
You know, when you don't have a shield on, you can't block that. Uh, that... I, I, I don't know where I thought I could actually get away with that. Yeah, it's, uh, that movie definitely is on. Alright, let's do this. Come on! So, what is the best way of uh, charcoaling these uh, guys? You know, it's not Christmas until you see Home Alone, A Christmas Story, and National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation, as well as Santa Claus, I'd have to say is number four. Fortunately, no channel ever want, no channel wants to run Home Alone this year. Keep the change, you filthy animal. Although I know they've aired it, I wish I did get a chance to see Jingle all the way as well with Arnold Schwarzenegger. Unfortunately, I only caught half of uh, the Charlie Brown Christmas special, and that was only because Kiki reminded me that was on that w one night. Okay, stop poking me. I'm not in any mood to deal with you guys. Well, I already got Bombos. Thank you, game. Why are you blinking, guard? By the way, yes, I found Bombos. You, you want to? You want to feel my Bombos? Well, the thing with Charlie Brown's Christmas is it really kind of showcases even more nowadays the issue with the holiday season and the commercialism. You know, that's the interesting thing about that show is that 1960s are kind of forecasting where everything has gone. Take a look at the TV shows that are coming on with a great holiday light fight, things like that. That's the thing that's interesting about it. No, not Rudolph! No. Oh, poor Rudolph. Another special I didn't get to see this year. I was going to ask you guys to guess the blue balls, but we're already at one. Two. Five. I should point out I should be done with this fight now. Thankfully, I didn't have to pay with another blue ball in another round. T 
TR is always cool. It's like every single seed I play, TR is a lump of coal. Okay, well, it was red, not too far off what you were thinking, Kiki. They gotta go with something you can tolerate. This is something you can definitely tolerate for a while. Let's go check, see what Catfish is up to. Hey, Tormad. What's going on with you? Alright, well, that's definitely a good find. Thank you. Entitled to your opinion. So there's a unique item above the pose. So that's going to be my next stop on this uh, tour. It's not the way you go. Could be the hammer. It might not be the hammer. Okay. That is an unique item. By the way, because I have the hookshot and have access to over here, something that BAMS was saying earlier is now fully true. I do have access. To Swamp Palace. This was quite the find last night when this turned out to be the hookshot. Not gonna be this case, but... That was a completely rude spot to have at last night in the uh, crowd control race. Okay. Great find! Wonderful! That hurt. You're not touching me. You're not gonna go ahead and touch me. Get away from me. The Raiders from OPT Lawyer. How you doing? Uh, I'm not certain how you get through that cave with the hook, uh, what you said. <laughs> uh, 
uh, you're supposed to very, very tightly move your way around that very, very top of the pit. Um, if you walk, if you hug the wall, you'll find that you'll be able to get through without without any issue. Um, I'm gonna intentionally take a death here. And that's so I don't take a death in the overworld. Oh wow, I don't have a lot of rupees. Never mind. So it turns out we have another Aghanim required seed here. All right. This is making me feel better about my life choices. The thing is, is that if I got hit by any of those things, there are those, uh, are those Pose? I think they're Pose. If I got hit by one of them, back to start, and that's a long walk, even though now I have the uh, Titan's Mitt. I swung my sword. I heard that swing. It didn't give me credit for that swing. That's nice, finding both dungeon items here already. Here's hoping that the key's locked in. By the way, I will uh, want to point this out. For a Lost Cards fan, you really are going to want to have to be paying attention to the stream coming up in about uh, maybe about three minutes from now. That's great. Give me the small key. Just give me the small key now, why don't you? Oh, the water toes. These those take the place of the flippers, and what that results in is you walk faster. The snow boots, yep. And that now walk, makes you walk faster on ice without slipping. I'll sh show that mechanic off shortly. But as I was saying to Laj, you're going to want to watch uh, coming up in about three minutes from now. Do not spoil it if you have seen it. That's rude. Shut up. Ooh, how did I get out of there without taking the two hearts damage? Now it's one hard damage. Oh, I left there too early. I had to wait for the time. I left just frames too early. Don't fail fish me.
You already have, but I still say don't. Okay, here's the juncture of this run. Please do not be a key. If you're item number three, then I feel better because then I know that blind will have item four and that the key can never be on blind. But instead, there it is. So there's going to be an item in that chest. Yay. Town is one of those two dungeons, uh, one of those dungeons where the keys can be in the chest. Here we go, Laz. This is the way the cookie crumbles. Powder? Oh, that's right, this was for coal! <laughs> well, I get to show off the boss anyway. Well, this is what, that wasn't coal, by the way, that was reindeer droppings. What am I doing? Let's go digging first. Do 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 do. Hey do 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 do. I wish this uh, game also had a Christmas theme to it. Coming up, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16... Yay! Absolute junk! I'm not visiting Kiki. You can't make me. Yay! School, uh, Thieves Town was completely necessary. Well, hi there, Z-Man. How you doing? What are you up to on this Christmas evening? Thank you. That was so kind of you. It's been pretty good. No major issues on the day today. How's your day been? Trust that you've been having yourself a fantastic holiday. 
Okay, now I could go to Skull Woods, but I cannot complete that dungeon just yet. You were at the in-laws, need you say any more? Well, yeah, that's a good point. That hurt. Okay, now next step I'm gonna go is to uh, the loop around towards Hype Cave. I thought I could actually clip into that. That would require having in-laws. Normal bingo cards? Oh, I got their attention box, so that's right. I probably should check this over here. See what's at the Haunted Grove. G fifty five zero. Oh, topical bingo. That's right, I do have uh, access to Meyer at this point. Meyer is beatable. Come on, give me a good gift. Yeah! 20 rupees. No, 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 no. I'll do Hype Cave afterwards. Unique items in Ice Palace. Okay, so laws. Those water, those uh, snowshoes. There's the effect of them right there. As you can see, I'm walking a whole lot cleaner on that snow. How are you skating on pavement or, or stone or whatever that floor, marble or whatever that is? Yes. Snowshoes takes the place of the flippers. The mechanic of them is that they will allow you to walk better on ice. I did not get any hint about this, so there's not much I can do about this. Get out of my way, thank you. You're encouraging him there, Kiki. Oh yeah, that's one thing you can't do in this mode, because they replace the keys 
and they moved them outside the door so that way you don't make uh, a oops with your keys. Z, you do whatever you want when, uh, regardless of whether or not we object. So yes, as you can see, the penguins take the place of the normal enemies in this dungeon because of the ice physics. If you're expecting something to happen in Ice Palace and... Get away from me. In change, you're going to be disappointed. Now, because of the ice, you can immediately go downstairs and don't have to worry about... Dealing with the lowering of the water. Because the big key is there, I'm going to go back upstairs and check that out. There's the red bobble. I just now need the blue bobble and now I can pull the pedestal. time and in this mode the hammer can be there that would not be a thing in any other mode I hate the fact that those guys just stay right there all right here we go Probably is more of a thing where they actually had to keep it um, the color of the boss for texture purposes. Okay, so Hammer now opens up a bunch of possibilities. I'm gonna continue on my current path. Well, blind is normally a brownish color, so the gingerbread works with blind. So they had to keep it the same color is what I meant to say by the texture. Okay, so that's nothing. Um, I don't think we ended up getting a hint about the Pyramid Fairy. So in this mode, you do not need Crystals 5 and 6 to get this. This is available as soon as you have access to the store. This uh, store. There is a unique item in ice, yep. My game plan at this point is to work my way around. Get this. Work my way over to the island. Check that and get into ice. Yep.
game. I don't like seeing the ice rod. Okay, I really would like for you to understand that. I do not want to see the ice rod. If it was Vanilla Ice, it would have a blue male in it, guys. I don't know why we're talking about Vanilla Ice. Well, there's the Ice Rod Cave, yeah. Blue Mal's in the... in... Uh, in... Ice Palace. Well, that saves me a check later on. This feels weird, walking on this ice without having to worry about the ice mechanic. Doesn't mean I don't have to pop in there. There's our unique item. It's the boots, and that takes care of why we got the hint for a unique item being in there. So that now opens up for our new items. I don't know what those are. Again, with the cane of burner being in his tower. Didn't you do that to me another uh previous scene? Okay, well that didn't work. Too far over. I think I actually stepped on that. Not that it really matters. Oh, if you want to see IEPBJ like a pro, then don't watch me in the uh, crowd control race from last night. I didn't even touch me. I was so waiting for them to invert my controls. Mizumari Key and a Mizumari Vicky. Oh god, okay. That's good to know. Extremely good to know. So if we get into go mode, then that's what we're gonna have to do. As it is, Misery Meyer is beatable. There's a small key. There's the big key. Kiki's right. It's probably vanilla. Nope, she's incorrect. It's 300 rupees. I don't really know what to do.
Kiki just missed the hint then that said that the Meyer small key and Meyer big key are in uh, left side Meyer. So, yeah, we can do the we can just uh, bum rush the remainder of this dungeon. Oh yeah, Gold Circuit tries best. Gold will be fair at 15 hearts, you better not. And this was Canis and Mario required. Alright. So it's pointed I can finish Myers, so let's head there. Dactyls with the snow caps on. And just for the sake of argument, it is Quake to get in here. Now that really mattered when you have all three of your medallions at 10 minutes in. Mmm, butter indeed. Desert Speedable 2, by the way. I need to remind myself that. Okay, and... Well, there's the fire rod. We're just a bow away from go mode. What the hint actually said was a Meyer small key and the Meyer big key are fire block, which means they're in that west wing of Misery Meyer. So that no being known to me at this point, that definitely helps things out. Actually, where it ran with a little more urgency, then I'd be perfectly fine. Oop. And now, because of that, oh, I thought he was going to turn this way. And now I can pull the pedestal. Which I'll do after I get done with the uh, Skull Woods. I have not popped in there yet. Hey, that hurt. So, what's likely going to end up happening here is this is going to be the small key, 
And under the rules, the logic, if this is, never mind. So small keys in the big key chest then. I stand corrected. I am finding all the keys. Could you please give me an item? I could really use the bow, please. Could you please give me the item? No, that's the compass. Please stop singing. People don't want to hear this at all. I screwed that up. Wait, I did open that. Oh wait, the bobble, that's right. Ar uh, Vitreus has the second and final item. Absolutely rude to me. Could you please stop doing that? That really hurts. I don't really like that. Could you please load me up with some magic in a jar? I don't know what I am thinking. But I do know TR is beatable. Hope everyone's having themselves a great holiday. So now that we're moving off from one holiday and moving towards the next one. What do uh, people have planned for New Year's? That'd be really nice to get the bow. Sleeping sounds like a good plan. Yeah, I gotta go back to work tomorrow and I've got one person I want to be out, they're out. The other person, yeah, that they're gonna give me more work to do. That's a heart container. Desert Palace, then up to School Woods and pull the pedestal. For me personally, I've got to go... Could I swing any more at him? I believe I've already picked up one item in here by way of the... Boomerang earlier, so I'm just looking for one. Then we go into go mode. We will not be stepping in foot of uh, TR at that point. Hey, thanks for the damage boost.
Hey, Dark Rupee. Merry Christmas. How you doing, buddy? Tough to say what a great equalizer would be in this version, only because it's all vanilla of the tower. Used to be Gan Warps and Agnum Balls, but that's like an item. We're done here. Head to three. Start the process of finishing up this game. Get away from me. So, you've got probably about three minutes or so to put in your picks and what you think is going to be on the pedestal. Uh, because, regardless, I'm going to be pulling it. Yep. I have not seen the mushroom yet. Good luck to you. See if uh, what's going on. Okay, uh, let's check this first. Only because this would be. I don't know, I probably should have done this second. In retrospect. Boing. Ow. Stop chasing me. That's the second item. Okay, so we go right to uh, Moldor. Uh, Mokula, rather. Taking that uh, hit away from me. Okay, let's see what we got here. Folly right there. Okay. Last chance to get your picks in for the pedestal. What's going to be on there? Is it the bow?
And the way I'm going to do this is I'm going to pull it first and then read the inscription second. Here we go! Well, it did begin with a B and O. So you guys weren't that far off in that aspect. Boo also begins with B and O. And the M is a backwards uh, or upside down W. Hey, Zara Selda, how you doing? Merry Christmas to you. Laws, you should just take credit. Ether. All right, Sarah Zelda. All right, so we've got Seven potential places where this bow can be that doesn't have me popping into Turtle Rock. Ouch. Yeah, that was a nasty seed right there, and that was a nasty result after all of that, too. It could be. Bow could definitely still be in POD. If it wasn't for the Red Igors, uh, Bo could easily be in the Eastern Palace. Here's our mushroom. Hey, you do the same. Hope yours has been going all right. Time to head inside of this uh, coal infested turtle rock. See if it's got the item we're hunting down for uh, the seed, the bow. Thank you for that now 85 minute old uh, hint. Yeah, I did not check that. Uh, Spike Cave is also on the to-do list. Oh, 
Oh, I'm glad I'm red mail for this. Of course, it's a god set up to my uh, to TR. That didn't go the way I anticipated it. So I'm going to put in this question into the chat here we for discussion over the next uh, 10 or so minutes. What do what is your favorite Christmas song? Traditional, non-traditional, comedic, doesn't matter. Christmas. That's right there. Is, that's my favorite of the Bob Rivers and uh, Twisted Christmases uh, tunes right there. that non-traditional BAMS and I got the hint about cash being in uh, Mimic Cave so don't need to worry about that for me I think I almost <sighs> Like, there's two songs that stick out. One from Vince Garaldi's trio, the other one by John Denver and the Muppets, the 12 Days of Christmas. I had a project my second year at Plattsburgh. Uh, when I was uh, doing my audio studies there and we had to record a High school there that was uh, doing a choir practice and the instructor was singing all I want for Christmas is you from Mariah Carey and The way he was emphasizing some of the high notes was uh, enough to draw me away from that song for years Just means that, uh, our dear friend Trinex is gonna have the final item. I think this is of the. This is going to be my first time actually fighting Trinex in festive mode. The previous two times I've not had to make it to him. Well, that's disappointing. Oh, 
Christmas time all over again. Tom Petty's also a good one, too. Christmas wrappings by the waitresses. That's also on the list. Turtle Rock was not the answer. The answer's in pod. Or Ether Tablet. Or Spike Cave. Or Peg Cave. Don't forget I didn't have the hammer when I checked that area. Or the four spots that are boot that were boot locked that I uh, said a while ago that I had access to when I got into Ice Palace. That's true. Also, hey, kill the rap. Merry Christmas to you. How you doing? And that is a no. Good luck with that killer rap. I'm so waiting for that to replenish my hearts. Got that. Merry Christmas, Shrevy. in go mode hyper strike Liquid Husband's not here, so we can't officially call it Bow Mode. We don't have his fancy emote here, so we can't call it that. Okay, if you want to do it in his steed, go right ahead. At this point in time, I'm more of doing of a curiosity thing. I'm going to go ahead and check the remainder of those uh, boot block locations, and then I'll make my way over to trade in that good old mushroom that I saw. Yay, 
Nice hat. That should be gift wrapped. Paying the monkey. Kiki, no matter what you tell me to do, I'm not paying the monkey 110 rupees. Shock the monkey is what is it? Isn't that Peter Gabriel? I don't have the money to pay the monkey more. I have to put those rupees to use for GDQ. Frampton was the one who do you feel like I do, or we do, or whatever the case is. Because you're worth a dark rupee. bits from Kiki with a charity tag. Thank you very much for those 100 bits. Okay, let's uh, do this the right way now. That's not the right way, okay? Not like I need any more. Hey, keys. I don't think I've ever seen having four keys in here on a non-key sanity seed. By the way, I still do need to play a key sanity uh, run at some point in time. I owe that to Slim Kirby. Okay, so there's that, and so therefore I'm done with this. Although I could have just easily have just went straight down and over.
Alright. Z-Man, are you still here? Yes, I did call. I have a question for you, sir. What are you doing tonight? Got it. That actually felt good. Too bad I probably won't pull that off the next time I do an NMG run. By the way, 10 night challenge will resume tomorrow night. You can do exclamation point 10 night challenge for information about the mode. Tomorrow night I will make my announcement on what will be the next game. I don't know how I lost that. Okay, let's stop being fancy like that. Nice. Nice start. Hey, uh, Shack Ninja, thank you very much for the host. Is Lance Card fan still here? Okay, well, you're going to want to be watching in about a minute and a half. I'm going to need those arrows. Yes, it is, Kiki. Uh, you missed your roll call, so therefore you've been reported as absent. You've been sent down to the principal's office. See, I was just curious if you wanted to do a Z1R coming up. How did I do that? How we can do in this vanilla fight. Eh, I wish I did that better.
Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be coming upon... Ganon's Tower like we normally do. It is now time to give you your guesses on what chest you think the uh, big key is going to be in. And if you want pink, there you go. Just take a look at that beautiful looking Christmas tree right there. Uh, I've got 12, I've got 8, I've got 1, I've got 13, I've got 18. Come on, get your numbers into chat. Uh, we have uh, Hippolyticus with 7, we have Shock Ninja with 16. Hyper Strike with 14. Mario Infinity likes it to be in number 22. Shrevy says, uh, 12. Yes, the snow does. It makes it feel like you're walking through that, uh, tall grass. Sarah Zelda says 17. That was interesting. At least now I know that my uh, fired or the enemy's uh, fired shot goes as fast as uh, Link's run animation. Alright, here we go! Which number is it going to be? Is it in number one? Eh, oh, nope. That's a net. Well, that's silver swell. I guess we don't have to deal with a silverless Ganon. Is it number three at the torch? Nope, that's a compass. Those are bombs, not arrows. Probably shouldn't do that. Nobody should come be, be nobody should be coming here for the songs. Number seven has just been checked. Number eight is next. If I don't do that again. Number eight is a small key. Sorry, mate. Number nine is coming up next. I did not do the sit at that block so I can get invincibility frames. Hey, Professor Chuckles, welcome. How are you? Merry Christmas. Hope all is well. Now it's time for Rando Room. Let's hand through 13. Number 10! 
Did anybody guess number 10? Nope, I think Kiki... No, yep, Kiki was the closest without going over at number 9. Thank you very much for playing. Now to time to go up the tower. Here we go upstairs. Is this going to be a good tower climb for me? Let's do this and get ourselves all set and ready to go. Dynamics, you're not fun. Here we go now. This is fine. Yeah, it was in chest number 10, Kiki. So you're the closest without going over. Don't I have potions? Here we go now. Up the tower. Upstairs. Up to the gauntlet. Time to kill, 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 kill. That is not how to do that. Do 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 do. Ah yeah, blinded. Oh, hi. How are you missing my sword? Let's not die in GT. This really sucks. I'm doing this bad. Maybe I'm not used to the ice. That's why, because I don't have ice visits. I got the snowshoes on. save some things one more thing wants me to do the thing without dying here we go hi whiz ropes you don't really scare me at all up oh, the tower I whiz robes, you're going down. Not really going to have a fight. Z-Man hasn't even answered my inquiry about 15 minutes ago. Why am I holding onto the pot without lighting the torch? Do I really want to do the torch glitch? Not at all. It is really not fun. He said he really didn't have any plans, but then I asked him if he wanted to do a Z1R coming up after I was done with this, and I did not really get an answer. You're not moving. Here we go into the last rooms. Now what is in the final chest of this game? Well, that was the burner that I was told about an hour ago. Dimoldor, what's in this final chest? Nobody's guessed it at all. Just ten arrows. Now time to play some geometry. That doesn't even make sense. This feels so weird without the ice physics. No.
Do 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 do. Yay, blue balls. Hey Z, welcome back. Just about outside. I was just curious if you wanted to do a Z1R coming up when I was done with this. That was that was what my question was about. Okay, I'm not gonna try it. Okay, well that was a good way of wasting some uh, magic. Do it. Ho, ho, ho. And for those of you who have not seen the ending credits uh, for the after game, enjoy a Hyrulean Christmas tale. Get the bonk counts, get your item menu times in there, or item count. Give me your item counts this time around. Give me your item counts. Tell me what you think the item count is going to be at the end of this. There are 216 p possible items. And don't forget I got early big key in Ganon's top. Well, not big, early big key, but it was uh, 10 out of 22. So. 176 from Z-Man. Shock is saying 18 bonks. Bams is saying 182. Professional Chuckles is saying 166. Epiblitic is saying 168. So. Let's find out.
Oh, Mario Infinity going with two on the uh, Price is Right rules. Interesting. By the way, this is going to be your first answer put down. Is what I will determine who actually is the winner, so... Choose wisely. I said choose wisely. Also, shout out to CCFRS uh, for the follow. Some love, some hype for CCFRS. I was thinking the same thing, Bams. Oh, Jingle Bugs, Ganon Hugs, Uncle Took the Bed. It's no fun when you can't run, when the, but the boots are on the ped. I guess pattern definitely was crap. I had money for Kiki, I just didn't want to spend it. Some wasn't cash though, it was bombs. I hate Moldorm Falls. I know, right? Alright, let's get to the important information. We well, got the sword at 551. Pegasus boots at 11055. 
All those gold sword boss kills. Alright, big key was number 10. Bonks was 21. Saves and quits, 16. Deaths, 1. Fairy revivals, 0. Lag time, that was yuck. Menu time, that was yuck too. Let me see what the number was for the total number of items. All right, let's see here. I'm gonna start going through chat right now. One more thing, you were over. Kiki, you were under. Laws, you were under. Epivleticus, you were under. Shock Ninja, you were under. Professor Chuckles, you were under. Z-Man was under. Bams was under. Uh, and, ladies and gentlemen, the winner. Guessing 182 is Bams. One off. The 183.